Hey, thanks for tuning in. It's your Dodge Dude, Mark Richardson, and today we're taking a look at this blacked out Jeep Gladiator. This thing has the high altitude package on it. Really cool. You can see already just from taking a look here, you have the painted bumpers, all black interior. You got some really cool things we're going to show you with this one. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So on this one here, you can see it has that painted front bumper got the black trim black trim inside here your LED lights and then the black wheels it's already got the running boards on it from the factory don't let the looks fool you though this thing looks like it's ready for the street but it still has tons of four wheel and capabilities still has that axle that's solid straight across that Jeep is known for and if you take a look underneath here you still see all that protective equipment that helps keep this thing ready for the trails and you can take these doors off really cool you got blind spot detection yeah proximity keyless entry on this jeep gladiator and look at the interior absolutely beautiful gorgeous interior you get that cross stitch all the way through on this thing and then you have that right there leather dash beautiful absolutely gorgeous interior even have that stitching here on the centerpiece all the way through on everything this little slot here is where your key goes you can just see all the detail they put into this thing absolutely gorgeous Get in the back here and take a look at the back seats. You can see that cross stitch comes all the way through the back as well. On your seats here. Absolutely beautiful. And then your rear passengers are gonna have a plug-in down here. And then they're gonna have some air vents. Your power windows are in the center of this vehicle. Got some speakers up top. This is gonna have a really nice Alpine stereo system. Headrest do fold down. And these things have great towing capacity too, around 7,000 pounds, depending on the way that they're set up exactly. See that Jeep there on the back? Everybody know what Jeep stands for? Well, it stands for uh, governmental purpose. GP is short for governmental purpose, Jeep, or people believe that it came from Eugene the Jeep, the mythical creature off Popeye that can actually do anything. Pretty cool. So you can see this one has a backup camera on it as well. And it has your pin connectors from the factory and the hitch all ready to go. It has a three fold Mopar bed cover here. And that's real easy to operate. You just flip that up. And then inside here, you can see you have LED lighting inside the bed with the bed line from the factory. Super nice. Got your tow hooks here on the back. And. On our key fob, you can see this thing does have remote start. Pretty cool. Fire right up for you. Got those LED lights up front. Has that Jeep look that everybody loves. You got the painted top on this one. Let's go ahead and hop in here really quick and let me show you this in the back. So in the back on this guy here, you're going to see you have a nice little spot to put all your hardware and then you have all this huge storage space underneath the seat as well, which is nice. Got the recovery equipment. This little plastic bag here is a holder for those two front freedom panels. This is going to come off as a three piece unit and then you're going to have that naked look that everybody loves from Jeep once you get the doors and the top and all that off. Then you can see here, you do have a, take regular gas, you do have a spot for your gas there, open this door up, for your seat adjustments on this side, you're going to have your back, so this adjusts this portion, this will lift the seat up and down, and then this is for the lumbar support. Hop inside this vehicle, and let's take a look. 
So in this Jeep Gladiator here, really nice. You have adaptive cruise control. So it's gonna be by car lengths and things like that. Got a push button start. Turn that puppy on. You can see all the gauges firing up. Shut that door. See that nice detailing on the steering wheel here. Get that Jeep name. You have the ability to change your driver display. It's pretty neat. You can see all sorts of different things coming out on there. Really cool. Your adaptive cruise control, all that. Real easy. Then on the back of the steering wheel, you're going to have some change the station and change the volume. And then over here on this side, you're going to have all sorts of cool things. Travel link. Fuel prices by brand, by distance, by price, within 10 miles of your local area. You can buy movie tickets from your phone. Guys, you can remote start this vehicle from your cell phone. You have access to a Chrysler Capital Assistant up here, SOS, Emergency Roadside Assistance, Universal Garage Door Opener. It is really cool, all the stuff they put into these vehicles these days. Then your safety and driving assistance. This has automatic emergency braking. Pretty cool stuff. So that means that this vehicle, this Jeep truck, is going to actually stop itself. Really neat. You can actually turn that off or you can turn it up. Whatever you want to do, blind spot detection, same thing. On this one here, you do have your Apple CarPlay Android Auto. You plug that in and you'll be able to see your phone up here on the screen. You can use your Google Maps if you want or you can use this navigation system which is powered by Google Maps. Really, really cool stuff here. The marketplace, you can actually find parking spots in your local area. There's not much that you can't do with a Jeep these days. There's not many places that a Jeep can't go. Thanks for tuning in. This is Mark Richardson, your Dodge Dude Approved. This vehicle is Dodge Dude Approved. Thanks for watching the channel. Comment, like, and subscribe if you have any questions about vehicles like this one. Or if you want to come on down and take a test drive, reach out to me at 505-358-5394. Thanks for watching the video, and you guys have a great day. God bless.